is what we do. You can have your beaches and mountains, your big cities and bright lights. Here, every year this time, crimson pours onto the prairie. And we rule. This is the land of the suitors. Seasons change, storms scar the earth and our hearts. But the people that live on this land are champions, resilient to their core. And they rise in unison again tonight. Tonight, it's football time in Oklahoma. Shotgun, back to pass, looking left, still looking, has time, throws across the middle, caught at the five, Saunders, touchdown, Sooners! And off Damian Williams to the 10, outside, 15, 20, watch out, 25, 30, it's a sprint for the end zone, the 50, 45, 40, 35, 30, forget about it, into the end zone, Damian Williams, an 89-yard touchdown run, touchdown, Sooners! the season opener. It's the Oklahoma Sooners and the Louisiana Monroe Warhawks. Here we go. Live from the Palace on the Prairie, historic Owen Field in Norman, Oklahoma. This is Sooner Football. Well, Oklahoma finished fourth in the country in third down percentage. They have third down and ten. Knight's second pass. He tucks it. He's got some running room. He's got the first down and then some. Cuts to the outside and is tripped up at midfield. 30 yards on the first carry of Trevor Knight's career. Well, he was trying to throw the football, had his eyes down the football field, nowhere to go with the football. Little stunt up front. You see the defensive lineman crossing. Offensive line picks it up well. There's a big gap in the pass rush lanes. He tucks it, and this is what he does so well. And second down and short. They'll try the ground game. Nothing doing. Out. The Sooners are there. And it'll be a loss of about a yard on the play. Nice penetration coming from Quincy Russell. And Grissom finishes it up. Grissom, former tight end, moves to defensive line. Back to tight end, back to defensive line. I think he's found a home. Browning from the shotgun, empty backfield. Pass is incomplete. Good defense by the Sooners. Uh, Washington had six receptions last year. He's got one tonight. Now he moves into the backfield. Browning keeps it after the fake, and he is going to be stacked up at the line of scrimmage. Good job fulfilling responsibilities for Oklahoma on that one. Browning from the empty backfield. Here comes some pressure. Double pumps. Hit as he throws, and that's going to be incomplete. Good pressure, though, coming from that defensive line of the Sooners, and that was one of the question marks coming into this season. They're averaging five yards on first down, making it second and reasonable. Oklahoma's one-yard run, making it second and long. Difference in the game. Yeah, that's why Knight's not getting a whole lot of help, and now Brown is getting tracked down. Oh. He extends the play. Good defense by Oklahoma. Not only did they put the pressure on, but they also had Julian Wilson there to swat it away. Louisiana Monroe 0 for 2 on third down. Closing in on four minutes to play in the opening quarter. Here comes some pressure. Browning feels it, lets it fly, incomplete. But it started because of the pressure of Oklahoma from the outside. They bring four. Browning going away from the pressure. Almost tripped up. Gets away with it. Slides at the 38-yard line. He'll lose a couple. Stryker had him in his sights and couldn't finish the sack. And second and long again. It's a 10. Here comes some pressure. Knight reads it up the middle. Tucks it over the 30-yard line to the 31. He'll be about a yard short of the first down. The keeper. First down, Oklahoma, up to the 35-yard line. Well, they're running an inverted wishbone and uh, letting uh, Knight read it out. And Knight tries to hurry it up as Louisiana Monroe still looking to the sideline and Finch right side got a little running room up over the 40 up to the 44 yard line now they've got Millard and Damian Williams in the backfield third down and just over a yard and a half Finch this time he is stood up fighting for that first down and I think he got it wow second and third effort individual effort right there on second down the pitch back to play looking for some running room the stutter step down to the 30-yard line. That'll be another first down for Oklahoma. Play, they can they can fly. Oklahoma quickly handoff left side, running room inside the 20. Again, it is Clay. They're down officially. They're calling it five and a half. 
Williams in the backfield. They look over to the sideline. Flash cards are being flashed by the coaches and signs being given. Knight looks left, throws left, complete touchdown, Oklahoma! Jalen Saunders with Trevor Knight's first touchdown pass of his career. That one had some RPMs on it. He got that ball out of his hand and put it right on the money with some serious velocity. You know, he's such a threat to run the football, you have to respect that in your pass rush, and he had vision and lanes, and an excellent route is run that time by Saunders, and Souter defense has kicked it up a notch. That's the strength of the game so far. That's the yeah. story of the game, how well they played defensively with this 3-3-5 look. They come with five. Browning reads it, hit as he throws. Incomplete. Ugh. Another great job with pressure. Tapper and company coming in hard. Crowd is incredibly quiet. Pitch looks for some running room, gets the crowd on their feet as he gets the first down. Third down and 10. Knight has the time. Deep out route caught over the 45 to the 46 yard line. Pass complete to Jazz Reynolds. Knight straight drop, looks right, throws right. Complete. First down, Oklahoma over the 45, down to the 43 yard line. Jalen Saunders again. Out of the cut, protection was outstanding. Going right back. Nice little stutter step by Shepard, gets in the clear. And that'll be close to yet another first down to about the 33 yard line. One first down of the first quarter, nine here in the second for the Sooners. Straight ahead run. Williams. Got the first down inside the 30 down to the 29 yard line. Well, this is the 11th play of this drive. They had a 14 play drive that went for a touchdown earlier. Knight runs the option, pitches back to Williams, looks for some running room, gets down to the 25 yard line. A little high snap, able to get it down, kick on the way. That's good. And the Sooners up the lead to 10 to nothing. They are one of six on third down tonight. And again, nobody in the backfield with Browning. Caesar goes in motion. Here comes the pressure. Browning hit as he throws. Penalty flag thrown as the pass falls incomplete. Uh, we're out of Jacksonville, Florida. And about four years ago, some fellows that were with the Jaguars and a couple of friends of mine in the air conditioning business had an idea to develop a football, air conditioning football bench. And yeah, they'll just go right back to keeping it on the ground. How about dancing around as Roy Finch? He's got some running room, needs one block to the outside. Cuts back inside, what a cut. Still on his feet. Loses about four, but he does get to the 50-yard line. 21 yards on the run by Finch. He probably went 40. At 40, I think he went 100. I mean, look at him cut back. I mean, he cuts back all the way across the football field and then cuts back again all the way back to the other side of the football field. Field. You talk about serpentining. Holy McAlandy. Talk to the coaches about Finch, and they have praised his work ethic. He's got 40 yards rushing on three carries. Knight keeps it inside the 40 down to the 37 yard line. That'll be another first down for Oklahoma. Plenty of time on the clock at 339. Little misdirection again and Miller's out there lead blocking for Knight. Knight turns it up the football field and. Yeah, we're back Sooners second down and seven. Knight straight ahead handoff. Nice job running again by Damian Williams. We've got Louisiana Monroe fatigued a little bit. They're standing up. You know, they're, they're not slanting and stunting as quickly as they did. Yeah, they were afraid OU would big boy them, and they're doing it right now, just pounding it away right down the middle. Now Miller goes to the tailback spot as Williams goes into the slot. Miller's got the football. Crashes his way inside the 20 to the 17-yard line. A 33-yard attempt now by... Michael Honeycutt, he's already got one of the books, and give him another in a letter sweater. Defensive line and linebackers put on the pressure. The back end and linebackers covered the pass, I and mean, there was nothing available. Montrell Washington takes the first handoff of the second half, and he has stood up for a loss of three. Shannon just scraped over the top. Everybody played their gap responsibility well, and Shannon inside-out pursuit was excellent. They had tying up blockers, and 
can't get Shannon cut off. And... Four man pressure. Browning just dumps it off. Oh, picked off. Intercepted by Julian Wilson. Second and 10. Knight keeps, gets a block, has the first down over the 35 down to the 30 yard line. Pickup of 17 on the play. First and 10, ball on the 30 yard line. Knight keeps it again, gets another block to the outside. He scampers out of bounds at about the 15 yard line. And we're also seeing Knight's running ability, 84 yards rushing the football this evening. First and 10 from the 15. Right up the middle inside the 10 down to the eight yard line. It's Clay. He is a beast when you stand next to him. 6'2, 253 pounds. Fester in motion. They keep it on the ground looking for pay dirt. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Finch, or, or Clay, I should say, finishes it off. He gets the ball in his right hand. He gets it inside the pylon for the touchdown. Before any body part came out of bounds, the ball got inside the pylon. Again, good blocking. Miller gets another one on the edge. Clay takes it to the outside, extends the ball inside the pylon. He's in bounds. His left knee hits the pylon. It's all good. Touchdown, Oklahoma. And you know, when I talked to Sherry Cole yesterday, we were talking about a recruiting class. She and Jan, they look at me and they said, we've got some good kids. I wasn't kidding. He's one of our good friends. Well, no doubt. He's the best. He's a good friend when he was at Missouri. Yeah, absolutely. Getting a little bit of running room is Damian Williams. They're trying to strip the ball away from him. Not going to do it, but he gets up over the 10 to about the 12-yard line. What's wrong with going, you right. know, 92 yards with the football? Nothing. And they're just going to keep it on the ground again. Tiptoeing down the sidelines up over the 15, <laughs> close to the 20-yard line. That'll be good for a first down. That's the strength of Williams. Oh, he unloaded on Lane. And Williams, he'll, he'll just lower that shoulder, dip a little bit. It's like a, a jab uh, for a box of boom. I mean, that's a thumper there. Uh, Big Duke Robinson, they want to be yeah. that kind of line. Light little fake. Out in the flat nice. pass is complete to Millard, and he just muscles his way up close to the 28-yard line. Monroe with six in the block box. Knight looks like a broken play, but he'll get the first down. Leaning over the 30-yard line, he is the heart and soul of this defense. On second and long. Oh, he just keeps it, leans forward, gets close to yet another first down. Pickup of 17 on the play for Trevor Knight. Patience, vision, awareness. Guy's got some scoot to him. I'll tell you, he, I don't know what his 40 time is, but he has got functional football speed. Wide to the left, and Browning again operating with an empty backfield. Sooners with only three down linemen. They bring four. Boom. Browning's pass caught, Oof. but put down right away. That's the way you tackle. Nice hit by Lynn. You talk about reading a route combination and knowing what to do, and a safety coming downhill like a linebacker and delivering a thump. Ball's out of Browning's hand, and Lynn is on top of the receiver immediately, if not sooner. Textbook tackling. Now they're facing Louisiana Monroe, who's looking at third and seven. Here comes the pressure. Browning steps up. Nice. Browning goes down at the 16. Great pressure again by Charles Tapper, the sophomore out of Baltimore, Maryland. Athlete. Athlete, yeah. Justin Minton, his eighth punt, and he's going to keep it. Tucks it. Gets hit. He'll be short of the first down. Sooners have it on the 18. I think Tony Jefferson, a hard-hitting safety, would have been proud of the tackle that Brennan Clay just made right there. No Absolutely. Doubt. No doubt. Knight keeps it. Nice play. Just dumps it off to Saunders. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Jalen Saunders, second touchdown reception of the night. Just an unbelievably clever play. Naked bootleg. You've got uh, Vincent Eddy in a sweat. Do I challenge the quarterback or do I stay in coverage? He was in no man's land and he stayed in no man's land. And Knight manipulated him and he just dumped it off to Sanders for a touchdown. And it's third down and 10 as we go inside of three minutes left in the third. Here comes pressure. Browning just has to dump it off. Sooners giving chase. 
not anywhere close to the first down, barely getting back to the line of scrimmage. You win on third down, you win time of possession, you win turnovers, you win the game, and Oklahoma's winning all three. Justin Manton's going to have to ice down the leg, going back to Monroe. <laughs> Another punt. Here comes Saunders. Tries to get away. Tip goes down the sideline. Uh -oh. Breaks through. Has some running room. Over the 30. Still on his feet. Inside the 20 yard line. 45 yards on the return for Jalen Saunders. Finch goes in motion. They look for Finch. They hit Finch. Finch stutter steps inside the 15 yard line spun around and that's where he'll go down it's third down and three inside of 50 seconds left in the third Knight, straight drop plenty of time looks down the middle throws, touchdown Oklahoma McGuire. McGuire, who had one touchdown reception last year gets his first of 2013 Ron, he's got the biggest hands. His yeah. hands are like like pillows with suction cups on them. They're soft and and they're and they're big. And he he is going to make a statement. He's feeling much more confident with the offense. And a, a play like that will up his confidence level dramatically. And, yeah. and Knight's first start could end up with three touchdown passes. Oh, what a night! <laughs> oh, okay, we're not done yet. I guess. Okay. <laughs> A second down pickup of about two on the play and that'll be the end of quarter number three first and ten for the Sooners ball on the 13 yard line Knight still in a quarterback and he keeps it again up to the 20 yard line for Knight and that'll put Knight yep. over 100 yards rushing this evening he blames nobody but himself absolutely no on fourth down Browning is scrambling looking throwing and he's going to have to throw it away and the Sooners will take over the football. How about that? And once again, fittingly, is taken to the turf and, and pressure coming that time from Frank Shannon, linebacker. First and 18. Ford up the middle takes a hit, still on his feet, gets close to the 15-yard line. They'll mark him down at about the 14-yard line. Bell looks. He's going to keep it. He's got running room up over the wow. 20, the 25. First down, Oklahoma. I'll tell you what, that's a bell dozer with uh, gears. I mean, he can shift gears. Change his arms. Did you notice that? Yeah, he, and he's lost some weight since last year. He's he is absolutely solid. Passes complete. Th that's how close this football team is, though. Good for us. Absolutely. Well, I tell you what, the Oklahoma running backs are dealing some punishment now that is Keith Ford again knocked the helmet off almost I mean almost the double chin strap almost totally dislodged lower the shoulder ba boom I tell you and it did come off he did dislodge the helmet and West Virginia of course coming to town next week and that can be seen on Fox Sports Charles Davis Gus Johnson How about breaking through again and spinning around is Keith Ford Ford showing us a little bit of running ability now the first quarter was a good one for Louisiana Monroe. Looks like they were moving the football, but since then they haven't done a whole lot on offense. And the Oklahoma defense on third down, led by Corey Nelson, stands up Washington. It was a great runner two years ago. Didn't do a whole lot. Kind of fell out of favor last year. I think they're going to be utilizing him a lot more. Bell has the pass complete. Let's see what he does after that unforced air, shall we say. Yeah. Bell's pass. Caught. Beautiful reception by Neal. And that'll be close to the first down. Clock inside of 240 now. Well, when you've had the success that Bob Stoops has had, you can recruit anybody. I mean, you can get in anybody's kitchen table and talk to the parents and the athlete. And he has got a bunch of football players. You can see, I mean, wholesale substitutions now. Uh, oh, actually bringing in the punt team. But wholesale substitutions on that second offense. They were great, no question. And his philosophy is put a ball down. You know, no excuses. We'll play anyone, anytime, anywhere. And uh, he came to Norman, Oklahoma. Didn't work out too well. Bob Stoops gets his 150th win. And he heavy dose of respect right there. Bob Stoops couldn't say enough good things about Todd Berry and the kind of guy he is as well as coach. Well, Bob goes to 5-0 and in August, 14-1 and in home openers, 35-2 and versus non-conference opponents at home. And Oklahoma gets their first win of the season. 34 to nothing. They pitch the shutout. That's the first shutout 
for Oklahoma in an opening game since 1999. That's Bob Stoos' first, first year. year. Yep. How about that? Final again, OU 34. Louisiana Monroe, nothing. For Dave Lapham, Chad McKee, and our entire Fox Sports crew in Norman, Oklahoma, I'm Ron Thulin. Thanks so much for watching. Good night from Norman, and enjoy your holiday weekend.